Morning paddlers, uh, day six, as you can see, it's pissing down. We could stay in the tent all day, because it's nice and dry, but we're going to have to go out in this at some point. <coughs> we ain't looking forward to it, we must say. But for now, we've got a coffee. I'm just going to try and sit it out. It seems to come across every half an hour or so, clear up a bit and then again. The river looks to be flowing faster now. So, as soon as we get another respite, we'll pack up. All that sopping wet gear there, just shove it in. Shove it in the boat and get down the beachy, hopefully by the end of today. I have no idea how near or far it is. No idea. Totally lost. I don't know how many miles I've done. In the 28 between Claremont and Vichy. I don't know. I haven't seen any signs. So we'll just have to keep paddling until we finish. Day six paddlers, you can see it's shocking weather, we're not happy, we're slightly miserable, it's better over there, but we're uh, quite weary now, just want it to be over, and as I say I don't know if I'm a day's paddle from Vichy or an hour. has risen a bit which makes it harder to go where you want to go because of all the debris <coughs> means you get chucked into a lot of things right, it's about four o'clock day six I believe some weird noise going on. I don't know if it's a dog or coming from over there. It's been car sounds around all day. I can't really hear any at the minute, but there's people along this part of the river, you know. So um, we're uh, we don't know how close we are to VC. Seven days altogether. 
Can we finish late last night? And uh, it was a hell of a slog. Behind that bush is the Vichy Tower. I've renamed it. It was in sight for most of the day yesterday. I seem to be going every which way around it. In the end, I got there. <laughs>